Yo, it is good, yo, it's your boy time back here with another video, and in this video today, guys, we're going to be talking about the new agendas added today, an NBA 2K23, my team, it says NBA records and moments. Now, here's the deal, you get a centerpiece exchange for completing each and every one of these, and look what's in here. Okay, you get an elite franchise moment, which I need. An, another elite franchise moment. An elite franchise highlight. An elite franchise highlight. A legendary franchise moment exchange. As well as what? Five other things that you can get from the trophy case option pack. Now, I'm wondering if I do have one of these trophy case option packs left, but I'm pretty sure you can choose another elite or legendary one out of those so it's just an absolutely incredible event that does last a while now if you're wondering where some of these other ones are there isn't a legendary franchise moment exchange that i need to get in week four parts uh part three eventually I, i'll go through and get this but now i've been waiting guys i had been waiting and waiting and waiting for the elite franchise moment exchange and now it's gonna be easy all i gotta do is score 100 points with a player in a game or uh, 55 rebounds over multiple games. Like, these are not hard to do. Yes, I mean, look, guys. Yes, okay. The 100 points with a player in a game isn't necessarily the easiest thing to do. But if you go into, I'm just going to say this, okay? If you go into the skill challenge right here, okay? And I would just do the post scoring one, okay? Because obviously you're not going to post score, you know, that many points. If you do those things, here's, the, here's, here's where you're going to be, okay? Score 100 points. Just shoot threes with Tim Thomas, Ricky Davis, Amy, Steph Curry, whoever. Score 100 points with a player in a game. That's easy. Combine that, you know, just score 186 points as a team. That's easy enough to do. Meanwhile, you can probably get 17 blocks as a team in that game and 55 rebounds over multiple games. It doesn't have to be with the same player. And then while you're doing that, you can get 30 assists with the player in a single game. Just assist to Tim Thomas or, you know, throw a pass to Steph Curry, whatever you got to do. Then, okay, if you really wanted to, and now this is getting gritty, you score these 100 points with Joe LMB. So you can kind of combo those up, okay? You get 17 assists with the James Harden, or 30 assists with the James Harden. You get Vucevic rebounds, so you throw Vucevic in there as well. And then uh, Evan Mobley blocks, you might have to do uh, on its own. And same thing with steals with D'Angelo Russell. But all three of these, are, all eight of these top things, you should be able to get done in one game. And that really should not be that hard. And with those, you get two elite franchise moments, two elite highlight exchanges, a legendary franchise moment, as well as an extra centerpiece. So at that stage, guys, look, we've got a long ways to go. But people right now, I think, can have 10 things right now. And after these, they're going to be able to at least have 12. Wait, no, more. So right now, you can have 10, right? Yeah, you can have 10. So people are going to be able to have 12 trophy cases completed if my math does add up. And so we're getting closer to people starting to have that, you know, Dr. J, that Tim Duncan's of the world. Now, for me, in my account, where am I going to go? Well... I'm going to go and get Jimmy Butler. So I needed this. Obviously, that's going to be done. The Cavs are going to lock in those. And then it's a matter of, is there anybody else that can help me out right now at this current moment? Alonzo Morning, maybe. The rest, probably not. So then maybe I just start my journey to Dr. J. I mean, that might be what I do. But this is exciting for me because Jimmy Butler for me is coming home today as well as another centerpiece is coming home. Literally an extra basically free centerpiece that is like a three hour grind. Like that is a massive, massive W. So here's the type of lineup I would recommend doing, okay? So I said with Tim Thomas, instead I'm just gonna do it with Joel Embiid. Joel Embiid's three enough, three ball is high enough if you did grind out the Joel Embiid, which I actually didn't do on this account, sadly. So I'm going to have to use this Joe Embiid, which, I mean, he's got a 76 three ball. That's going to be just fine. So I'm going to need to score 100 points with Joe Embiid. And once I do that, this is going to be done. This is going to be done. Those are going to be done. Now, 55 rebounds over multiple games, that can happen. What I'm going to do is I'm going to run Vucevic at my power forward position. So hopefully Vuce's, Vuce's price hasn't gone up that much. I'm guessing it's just already crazy expensive. Let's see. Oh, no, he's not that bad. I'm going to buy Vucevic right now. 
because his price is only going to rise. I'm just telling you guys that right now. Get on Vooch early because his price is only going to rise. He's going to be my power forward. So then you guys might be like, okay, Ty, how else are you going to complete this? Well, Embiid, Vooch. Those things are going to be easy to do. Vooch is, what does he need? 22 rebounds. That is going to get done in this game as well. Um, and that's over multiple games. So even if I don't get it all done, that is a okay. Uh, and then 55 rebounds in the game. And then all you really have to do is put James Harden in the game too and get 30 assists with him. So, I mean, it's not like these challenges are very hard. And, and, and I'm just going to run the ferocious James Harden, get assists with him. Boom. It's, it's really not hard to do. Now, again, what I would recommend is just plug in golds in these areas. And if you're wondering why, so they don't steal rebounds from like Vucevic, those types of things. And again, guys, just go into this skills challenge and make it happen, right? Again, if you are going to do it with a guy like Joel Embiid, then maybe you want to do uh, something else. Maybe you want to do mid-range scoring and then just make sure you don't score in the mid-range area. Might be something to look at because inside scoring, you might have to do some post moves with Embiid uh, to score those 100 points. But I don't think anybody is going to uh, disagree that these are a massive W. I mean, they, they, it's just a massive W for the My Team community who has needed this. I mean, even for a no money spent player, they can go get all of these done within a couple of hours, a few hours, and at least get their first trophy case exchange. Now again, if you are new to my team, wondering what trophy case I'd recommend, well, I'd recommend Russell Westbrook first, and then James Worthy second. Now, if you do have multiple like, you know, centerpieces, then I'd recommend going for the Anthony Davis, but obviously that is easier said than done. Most people aren't gonna have, you know, more than one or two, so. I'm glad 2K is speeding up the process with these trophy case cards because it needs to happen. It, it's that simple. It definitely needs to happen because like for me, for example, I needed Jimmy Butler to come home. I, I needed that more than anything. So the fact that Jimmy Butler is going to be home is going to be a massive W. And then I can really start building my squad to what I want it to be, right? I, I can add Jimmy Butler to the squad test out new lineups, figure out, you know, what exactly I want to be. But it really starts and ends with completing these uh, these trophy case agendas, which, again, really should not be that hard to do. Again, I would recommend comboing some things up because uh, I, I don't know what comes out of these trophy cases. If you can get another a legendary or elite moment out of these, just know, man. Just know you're going to see a lot of trophy case players on the court here in the very near future. Hey, 2K, all I can say is hold the W, man. Hold the W because you guys took one today by dropping all of these. Now there's more centerpieces than ever to be redeemed. Uh, you know, more trophy case players that you guys can add. And I'm excited, guys. Jimmy Butler is finally going to come home for me in NBA 2K23, my team. It's felt like it's been a long time coming. And to see it, you know, kind of finally happening is a massive W. Now, one last thing I'm going to talk about or look at is, you know, I need to get these done. So, you know, can I get these done and then combo it up with one of these challenges? Maybe, right? That might be something I can do. So, just something to kind of keep in the back of your minds and think about, you know, I got to get these done really before anything because I need this legendary franchise moment exchange before this season is up as well. But that is going to wrap it up, guys. Definitely would take some time. Grind these out, even if you haven't even started the trophy case kind of system. Drop a like on the video. Subscribe if you are new. And as always, man, I love you guys. And have a blessed day.